What's up guys, welcome back. My name is Sean and today... Oh, who loves the flow of this? Shoo oh. up! The emotion, the power... And then it just explodes! <laughs> okay. What's up guys, welcome back, my name is Sean, and today we're going to be reacting to Stray Kids with Taste Circus and Case 143 at MBC Kyo Dejejan 2022. So yeah guys, we are back with some more Stray Kids, and since it is MBC week, we are getting into, well, their appearance on MBC Kyo Dejejan 2022. This time around, they are doing something a little bit different, because we have the dance Raka coming in with, uh, well, with a, I'm not sure if it's just a, their song, or if it's like a, a cover, choreography cover, dance cover, something along those lines, I have no idea, but they are going to be performing a song called Taste, which I have no idea what, I've never heard that song, so I am very, very excited to be getting into that one, and then, Strike Hits, uh, well, as a full group, are going to be performing Circus and Case 143. Now, obviously, Obviously, we've uh, seen them performing Case 143 and I think all of their performances, like they did it at KBS and SBS, I think. Um, but this time they are doing Circus, which is their Japanese release. So I'm a bit excited to see if they are doing the Japanese version or the Korean version, if there even is a Korean version. Either way, I'm excited. So let's get right into the first one, which is Dance Racker with Taste. The like the moves are on point already. So it's a full on song, okay. Alright. Alright. Damn! That was really quick, very sharp movement. Mm. Okay. Wow, okay. All right. You make you feel my love. Okay. Oh, it, it just keeps on picking up. Like, even the pace that they're moving at. Oh. 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 And they're doing all of this extra stuff, but oh, <laughs> see they're executed is so, so I don't know, nice. So satisfying is the word I'm looking for. Oh. Oh, even that little damn. Okay, that was a dance record with taste. I gotta say that was incredible. Like, yeah, we already used to Stray Kids themselves being very, very good at dancing, but they don't usually have this uh, this very, I guess, contemporary dance uh, within you know within their normal music or at least within their title track. So seeing the dance tracker here coming in with something that is first of all very high paced, you can see in all of their moves they are super super quick, very very sharp and well executed, and on top of that incredibly well synchronized. So that is already an incredible plus. But also just them going in with a little bit of a different a different kind of dance. 
a different kind of choreography from uh, from what we're used to is really really cool to see and they are damn amazing and even then it wasn't just a dance cover it was actually you know a full-on stage they were singing and everything and I feel like that just adds to how how cool the whole dance and everything is because it's not just a choreography it's actually a, a stage they are doing everything that's really really cool but let's move on and uh, and get into Stray Kids' Circus and Case 143. Okay, yeah, it is the Korean version, okay. It's been some time since I listened to Circus. Alright. Stage is the oh, that was full backup dances in the background and then just seven mem- Okay. Alright. Alright. Uh. Hey! So it's a, a quirky song in a sense. I really like that. Yup. And keep it going. Keep it going. All right. Ooh, 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 that's kind of slick. That's kind of slick. Okay. Hey. Ooh. I don't think I've seen the full choreo before. You didn't watch dance practice, so. Okay. Loving the build. The smile. All right. Oh. Oh. Let's go. Dance break time. Okay. God damn. Oh, that's kind of cool with, uh, who's it in the middle? Doing... <laughs> Alright, I think that was like a shortened version of... Was it the full version? I think it was a shortened version of Circus. Maybe one chorus less or something. Into case. Hey! Loving the fans screaming, you know? Hey! <laughs> okay. okay, let's have this beat built. Oh, it's such a good song, you know. This drop and this like this beat and everything, it's so good. I love you. Ooh, a little, a little good jump from from Chad. Yep. Ooh. I 
like it. I'm really digging Shenzhen's hair color, you know? Okay. Man, that repositioning everything is so good, you know? See that right there, the spins? Mm. Yup. Hey, hey! Such a good climax, you know? All right, uh, that was Stray Kids with, well, both Circus and Case 1, 4, 3. I love, first of all, the fact that they are performing Circus because obviously there's a Japanese comeback, which uh, they don't often do or groups don't often do in, on their, well, at Korean award shows. And unless sometimes they do it if the, uh, you know, the award show takes place in Japan, it does make sense for them to do it. But obviously because it is in Korea, it doesn't necessarily make sense to do a Japanese song. So... They still went and did Circus, just the Korean version, and I love that. It's the first time I'm actually seeing the choreography and everything. I think it was shortened a bit from because I, I believe the full song is three minutes. I may be wrong, but I think there's maybe just a chorus uh, that was shortened out or something along those lines. Incredible stage, along with Case 143, which we've seen the stage so many times by now, but every single time I just enjoy the stage so much because it is such a cool hook. It's such a, a catchy hook, and you know, the dance and everything, and just, yeah, it's, it's just hard not to move around when you listen to Case 1 for 3, even though you've listened to it like 10 times now. But yeah, guys, that was Stray Kids with Taste, Circus, and Case 143 at NBC Coyote Jujun 2022. First of all, I gotta say, their dance track. I think this is the first thing I've seen, like, actually from the dance track outside of, well, the, the, the small takes we saw in uh, in the guide. But I think it's the first time, uh, or the first thing we've seen of them together here on the channel. And it was incredible. I, I, I can definitely see why they are called the, uh, you know, the dance unit or the dance racker. Because, well, Stray Kids are already some very, very incredible dancers i mean you gotta be when you have such a an an upbeat kind of music and high paced kind of music as they have and then to you know perform a stage for that kind of music you need to be good at dancing dance record though they really take it to another level with their contemporary but still very very upbeat dance it's super super cool to watch and of course circus and case 143 two absolutely incredible stages here at NBC. probably you know this this might actually have been my favorite stage from stray kids of the stages they've done you know, SBS, KBS, and uh, and NBC. This was just so damn dope. For now, let me know what you guys thought about Stray Kids' Taste, Circus, and Case 143 at NBC Coyote Jujun 2022 down in the comments below. And I guess I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>